Oh, hello there. Welcome to 165 Entertainment. My name is Luby, and I'm going to be playing, for the very first time, Axiom Verge. It is an indie game that I've heard a lot of good things about, so I thought I'd, uh, thought I'd give it a shot. And as always, before we begin, I just want to add, oh, wait, hang on, hang on. Oh, my other cell phone shut up. I always do that. Um, before I begin, I just want to cover a little business, as I usually do. Uh, first off, we have officially been uh, made eligible for affiliate status with Twitch. So thanks to everybody for watching us, for following us. Uh, there's a little bit of uh, paperwork we got to fill out, but very soon we will officially be Twitch affiliates. For now, we're still just operating as normal. Mitch is asking, what is this game? Supposedly, it's um, it's a pretty popular Metroidvania, as they're calling it. I'm not sure you've heard that term before. I've heard a lot of good things about it, and there's a, there's a sequel that's supposed to be coming out later this year, so I wanted to see what all the hype was about, and then see if I want to invest in this in the future. So, uh, a little more business. I definitely want to shout out Greg. Thank him for doing some fill-in streams over the weekend. I was unable to stream on Friday as I normally do as I was at C2E2, which I might have uh, a story or two to tell while I stream. It kind of depends on how intense this game is. And then also thanks to Gibbo for filling in for the Donovans yesterday as they normally stream on Tuesdays. And I think that's all I have to cover, at least for the beginning so let's ooh, excuse me let's dive into this if uh let me know how the sound is because the first thing that i noticed when i fired up this game is that like it's 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 loud and it's like i i, I know it's not like the best way to describe it but it's like because the music is awesome but it's just when i fired it up it was already so much louder than like any other game that i own so let me know if the volume's okay and the other uh, awful thing that I noticed is that uh, this game is kind of operating, I think, on on Xbox controls. So basically, everything in these menus to uh, sound awesome, but no sounds yet from the game. Okay, so I need to I'll need to bump this up a little bit because there is music playing. this game goes and how quickly I might finish this we'll see uh, let me know if you hear the music now uh, do, 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 yeah let's uh, let's dive in new game let's do normal New Mexico 2005 oh what were you doing in 2005 I was in high school this trace it's charged and ready Ooh, thanks heaven starting the oh god the text is too fast what is this some <laughs> yeah what the fuck get up get off the 165 account <laughs> Uh, Trace, that's a problem. Let that sound. <laughs> oh. As the building collapsed on top of me, I knew it was all over. My life, my goals, all fruitless. But if this were truly the end, if I'd simply die... Uh, God damn, the text is so fast. Come on, I'm trying to, I'm trying to build... You know, a little atmosphere here. Okay. So, I was in an egg. Trace. Wake up, Trace. Oh, look at me. Dude, I got mutton chops. 
This is awesome. I look like Gavin from Rooster Teeth. Trace, there is gun in next room. You must get it. What's going on? Where are you? Hello? Where am I? You're in the Axiom Verge, son. Alright, so I can use the D-pad or the joystick. Press up to save in the egg. Ah, oh, dude, I'm feeling this. This this feels this feels right. I got gun. Holy shit, this thing's huge. Uh, lock position using left bumper. Shoot with Y. Well, I, th I okay. So I actually changed the control. At least I think I changed the control ahead of time. The Axiom Disruptor. Is this the gun that lady mentioned, or did I? Oh, is it her? Sorry, I am very weak. You must go now before he finds you. For who finds me? What's going on? <laughs> Give it whatever, whatever it is you're, you're trying to type. It's definitely getting censored. Uh, I can only use my imagination. I guess she's gone again. Okay, so I'm, fi I'm fine with these controls. All right. And then, yeah, lock in place, holding L's. All right. Can I... Okay. Ow. Okay, so those regenerate. Might as well. Didn't do much, but how much of this stage is going to be filled with these regenerating bubbles? I don't know. They're kind of annoying. Oh, that's Metroid as fuck. Disrupt. Must disrupt. Ooh, what's up here? Oh, it's just a dude. It's a monster. Okay. Does that include the blowies in the park? Uh, do you want to talk about that here? I got, I had, I had a, I had a blowie in a park once. It was, it was actually, it was the very no, was it? I think it was the very first blow I ever had was in a park. Can I charge this thing? No, okay. It feels weird to talk about something like that when I haven't really been drinking. In fact, I haven't been drinking at all. So like just <laughs> just hearing that like coming out of my mouth is like, what are you doing? Okay, so I can't go through there yet. Yeah, all pretty straightforward. It's a figure of speech, but it's good. <clears throat> well, look, it's a figure of speech for you, but for me, it's reality. Die! Come on! Explode! Kind of wish. Okay, so these guys don't really do anything. I also don't want to underestimate him. Oh, there's a door, like, above me. Might as well check it out. Yeah. Uh, mm, I probably can't get up there yet. There's probably something that... Oh, wait, no, okay. Oh, hey there. You're a little different than a little... Oh, shit, damn it. Not what I meant to do. Okay. 
Cool. Let's damage uh Hold fast. <laughs> Craig, is that is that what the hell? Okay, yeah, that hurts. What uh Okay, so I can't even climb anything. This is really not uh Watch them do the final boss when you're here. <laughs> Yeah, dude, this is, this is nothing. All right, I got to go. This is, it's just eating my health and nothing else. It's useless. I got to kill these fucks again. Where can I get some more health? And I'm glad all you guys are just shooting downwards where there are zero threats, seemingly. Hey, y'all. Okay, there's. I think that was a health pack. What is this? Okay. Uh, I'm assuming whatever power I'm going to earn next will allow me to get that thing and that's nothing like that. <sighs> you guys that's the, that's the game thanks for yeah look we've I'm pretty sure we put somewhere on our channel that we're more like a PG-13, maybe soft R. Firing once launches a projectile, firing again causes it to detonate. Oh, okay. I got gotcha. you. Cool. I don't trust myself with it for now. So I'm just going to stick with the disruptor until I get to that one. Ugh, excuse me. Yeah, this gate. Okay. So will this Nova shoot through the shoot through those like weird blue shit that I was facing up earlier yeah die slowly good show okay this is taking a little too long 2FA what is that What are you saying? Oh, come on. Fine, I'll switch back. Die, 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 die. Wait, you must also die. Alright, so I'm almost full health. Yeah, so the, uh, this past weekend I was attending C2E2 for my, it was my sixth year going there, and it was a lot of fun, but I also didn't really make the most of it. The, I was kind of sick going, uh, going into it, and then like as soon as I started feeling better, then just... My sinuses were like assaulting me. Um, so there's uh, two factor ident identification. Authentication, rather. So I, I, you know, I just got over a lot of that stuff too now, and hopefully I'm healthy for good this time. Because it's, it's just old. You know, the weather's starting to turn. I did manage to get out. 
go for a nice run the other day. Got to get back into the habit of doing that. But anyway, mo uh, the f the first day the first day of C two E two. My my, it's hard to call it a problem, but like there was there was so many panels that I wanted to attend that day, and they all kept running into each other. So I had to wind up choosing some of the panels that I wanted to attend. And I feel like I made a lot of the wrong choices. Because I just, I didn't quite have as much fun in the panels as I wanted to. It was, they were still fine. But, oh, okay, I got you. I got a Nova, this, this bad boy. Thank you. So I attended, I attended this one panel that talked about, um, about streaming tabletop games, which is something that we've, it's not quite a market we're trying to get into just yet, but it's, it's something that I think we want to try eventually, probably sometime before the next extra life, I imagine we'll maybe give some kind of tabletop stream a chance whether it's like a full-on campaign or if it's just like a, a basic board game or something like that that currently remains to be seen what do i do here the hell is there something underneath all this uh goop yes there is Size node permanently increases the projectile size for weapons. What? What do you mean projectile size? Um. That I, maybe that looks big. I'm 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 confused. So, all right, so yeah, like I said, it's the first panel was for tabletop streaming. And then I think right after that, I was starting to sit in on this panel for Star Wars books. It, it was actually titled, uh, the, the name of the, the panel was Star Wars novels or books or something like that. And so I was hoping to go in and learn more about this, uh, this High Republic series that's gonna be coming out in August. But then it kind of turns out that all it was real, all that panel was really amounting to was they were kind of doing like a profile on the woman who authored the novelization of The Rise of Skywalker, which is cool and all because actually, play Monopoly, dude, I would, I would gladly do that. I actually have. Monopoly on my Switch. And we did stream that once, but the game surprisingly did not last very long. So I'm down to stream it again at some point. Um, anyway, so... Yeah, the, the, the panel just really wasn't all that interesting. What was kind of cool, and I, I think it was a pretty big step to proving some legitimacy towards C2E2, was that even though uh, this Rise of Skywalker novelization doesn't actually come out until uh, I think the 13th of March, they actually released that you know they they were starting to sell copies early at C2E2, so that got a lot of a lot of people excited. And while in a way I'm you know I've been looking forward. What the hell is that? That's interesting. While I've been looking forward to learning more details about Rise of Skywalker, it's like I'm not going to buy a novelization of a movie. A lot of what I want to learn is going to be shared by people who buy the book. And then just, you know, we'll write up YouTube essays about it and, and all that good stuff. So it, I, I wound up leaving that panel early and then going to... A Jackbox Games panel, where they uh, they played they played tri uh, Trivia Murder Party Two, 
And they actually showed a feature on there that's really cool. Something that, that my group has yet to see while playing through that game. And it's something that I don't quite want to spoil. But it's, it's similar-ish to the original Murder Party where, um, like, when you would cut off your finger and that would limit the options that you would choose. It's like that, but way more interesting and in-depth. Okay, I don't think I've gone through here yet. I have not. Okay. So they played that. They played... Fuck, what else did they play? They played that. They played Dictionarium. Oh, God. Okay. You need to calm down. Man, my accuracy is awful. I'm trying to remember what the last one they played was. Anyway, the, basically they play games and then they also announced that... I uh, yeah, let's save. They announced that Quiplash 3 is going to be a part of the Jackbox Party Pack 7. And the trailer that they showed for that was really funny. It was very misleading, but it was really funny. So I had a I had a decent time at that panel. And there was one other thing I okay. Hang on. Things have gotten quiet. I have a feeling this is gonna be a boss fight. And also this door is red. It is one hundred percent gonna be a boss fight. Yep. Oh hey there. Crap, I'm trapped. Demon. Hey, you can talk. Listen, I'm I'm lost. Demon, a Thedos say kill. All right. Okay, so I can. Looks like I can. Oh, hey there, hey there. You need to calm down, sir. Um, anyway, sorry, I'm, I'm a little bit focused on the boss. Oh god, hey there. Why does it seem like he's not really hurting me? I don't want to test any theories or anything. Ow, okay, there it is. Oh, so they just explode. They don't hurt on contact. Or at least those, those larger missiles that he's dropping. Those ones. I was hoping to get through unharmed on this bus. Ah, shit. See, this music is dope. I, I think so far that's that's my favorite thing about this game is the music. Yeah, I got him. Woo-woo! I did it! Yeah, there was, there was one other panel that I attended that day. I don't remember what it was. And uh, what I'm going to wind up doing is laser drill. High power drill. Ah, okay, here we go. ZR. Ah, uh, that's awesome. It's a lot slower than I thought it was going to be, but still really cool. I wonder how it'll do in melee. Nova. Haha, <laughs> yeah. Um. Oh, okay. Really? Uh, that's weird. What's this do? Permanently increases weapon and item damage. Okay. Do I it? Okay. Wait. Upgrades, power ups. Do I have to actually? Okay. Never mind. And that's supposed to be back. 
It's really weird that this kind of selectively just goes through shit. Or the, the red rocks, anyway. I'm not fucking with you. You're insane. What's here? Yeah, let's save. We'll do the boss fight. And as for the cosplays, oh, you know what was kind of, I, I guess, kind of funny going back to that Star Wars book thing. So, uh, no, no spoilers in chat because apparently there's still some people who haven't seen Rise of Skywalker. Um, there was this one girl who, who bought the um, that Rise of Skywalker book and was reading it waiting to go into the panel yeah here we go and she was she, like she apparently oh god was our she was already upset by the the end result of Raylo and so she talked to the author before buying the book hang on I gotta I, I want to re-equip my disruptor she was already upset enough so then when she talked to the author before buying the book and the author you know props to her was like if you're already upset you're not going to be any less upset if you you know if you read the book and the author said like go to go to basically the last five pages or something like that of the book and read through that and you'll see you know what I've done, you know, what I've written about, what happened. And apparently it affected this girl so much that she just like straight up started crying before the panel started. I was like, oh, holy shit, like what? You know, you've already been having to, to deal with what's going on. You've, you've had months to marinate on it. So it's, it's kind of interesting that you read a few more words about it and you're already crying again. That's it, it, it shows that even though I, you know, I don't think they did the best job. They did a fine job with those two. I don't think they did the best job. They could have done a little better, but it, like, it's still for a lot of people. It, it meant the world to them. So admittedly, I was kind of like in my own head laughing at the girl for reacting that way but at the same time I was like all right you know what it's people having extreme emotional reactions to some of their favorite stories it's it's really like the best thing you could hope for because even if it's bad I feel like getting any kind of reaction like that is is almost like the, the goal because otherwise like if, if you're not gonna react then I feel like you're not really invested either I don't know. Maybe that. Maybe I'll, I'll get a better jump moving forward. Dude, this drill. This drill. Oh, it's my favorite thing in this game right now, other than the music. Expand a jump. Expand a jump. Health node. All right. Uh. So Saturday. Saturday, I only wound up attending one panel, and it was another Jackbox one, where basically, well, it was, it was like a co-Jackbox panel. So what they do, and it seems like they're they're going to be leaning into this a lot, that they're going to be trying to do this every year, is they go up against. Uh, all right, so the Jackbox people, they bring up a couple of their writers and a couple of their artists and then they invite the cards of uh the cards against humanity company to do the same to bring up a couple of their artists and a couple of their writers and they play one of the jackbox games called tko where basically um 
people draw oh god oh god people draw a t-shirt design and um you know the artists draw a t-shirt design the writers write some like weird phrase or slogan or something like that and then they bring a bunch of people from the audience up to the stage and they say from the phrases and t-shirt uh and um drawings that are you know that are in front of you put together the best and funniest t-shirt that you can god i want you to die can i and so like uh my personal favorite shirt that i saw oh god was uh someone drew like a basically a naked santa doing kind of like the what was that suntan lotion where the girl was is like having her her bikini being pulled by the dog so it, it was basically that pose with like you know your back turned but you're you're basically like your butt sticking out and you know you're oh go, hey there you're rude copper tan that's what it is yeah so someone drew basically like a topless Santa in that pose and then just one of the writers wrote the phrase yum 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 <laughs> and that's the t-shirt that I thought was gonna wind up winning the day but the one that did wind up winning was kind of like a, a lame political one it was it said it said Bloomberg 2020 and it had a picture of a turd sandwich which I mean I, I get it it's an it's, kind of like a nice what the hell little you know nod to South Park but I thought the Santa one was funnier and so what's interesting is that what's going to be happening from every year is that whatever t-shirt wins that competition they're actually going to sell those shirts and that's kind of the same way uh, that's kind of how they do it with the actual video game version of TKO is that whatever shirt that you and your friends design you can actually order that shirt online. So if you want, you can buy a Bloomberg 2020 shit sandwich shirt. Hey there, I've seen you before and I don't know if you are friend or foe. Oh boy, Trace. My name is Elsa Nova. Is it supposed to be Elsa Nova or Elsa Nova? We are connected through my machine. It's Spanish. Okay. So the aliens are Spanish. That's what, because we're in, cause we're in, <laughs> all right. I don't want to go too far down that rabbit hole. <laughs> Power filter. I guess I can try. Where is it? Not near. I'm sorry. I need rest now. Bye. Wait, where are we? Need rest now. What is this? Better jump, better jump. Kilver fires a short range burst of electricity. Oh, it's like a shotgun blast. Bah! Wake up, bitch. It's oh, okay, El, El Sinova. Can I? All right, fine. I'm already switching off of you. Oh, hey, that's that's rude. Yeah, so that was I think that was the only panel I attended Saturday. And <laughs> What was kind of funny, but also really annoying, was that I spent a lot of my Saturday trying to find, um, so basically what happened was, Saturday morning, I stumbled on this booth of this artist 
who had a bunch of Fire Emblem Three Houses drawings. And, I mean, you know me. I love my, my posters, my prints, all that stuff like that. And so I was like, I, I, I want these drawings. And, well, before I got the chance to say that... Okay, I got to break it from the side. Before I got a chance to say that, she's... Uh, because there was also like one other person next to me that was looking at her drawings. It's quiet. Okay. Um, there were a couple of us looking at her drawings, and she said, "All right, I'm not, I'm not open yet. Give me another like half hour or an hour or so." And so that's when I went to that Jackbox panel, the Jackbox Cards Against Humanity panel, and by the time I got out. I couldn't remember where her booth was. And so I, I, I don't know how this happened, but I wound up combing the place for like two hours trying to find this, this lady's damn booth. I don't know what, what it was. I just, I couldn't fucking find it. Until I eventually, she, she just happened to be like really close to the, to the, um, the gaming section, which was bigger than ever this year. It was really cool. They had a shitload of arcade games, a shitload of console games. They hosted a bunch of tournaments, stuff like that. So that is what I'm kind of chalking it up to was... Wait, I was just here. I still can't get up there. I was probably so distracted by all the game stuff that I just flat out didn't notice her her thing there the whole time so I'm gonna wind up posting a couple pictures of the prints that I ordered and I might even link this artist's store damn it I don't really like this inventory switching system it's not the most ideal oh god he's after me uh, she's got a lot of really good anime prints. I don't really care about anime stuff, but it's just her art is is so fucking good. Cause I, that was, you know, that was actually one. God damn it! I hate you. That was actually one of the first things that I did was I walked through Artist Alley, hoping to find some some Fire Emblem stuff. Okay. I. I I need whatever's in there. And so there were a couple booths, a couple artists that had some Fire Emblem drawings, but they just weren't that good. And I kind of hate saying that because obviously, like, it's it's better than anything that I could ever put together. Even though, I, like, I used to draw and I used to be fine, but god damn it, this guy sucks. I should use that sh stupid... Yeah, yeah, I know. Oh, God, these things suck. I hate them. Yeah, fuck you, Howard. I'm dying. Um, yeah, all these people's Fire Emblem drawings were just... They, they weren't that good. Because... The, the thing... Of, whoa, shit, that's a huge pile of corpses. My God, look at that! It's a mountain. The problem is... Like, the dimensions... like of the characters were just they were always just wrong and just didn't really fit because I mean they're anime characters so then what I think people were trying to do was kind of uh, humanizing them a little bit is one way of putting it and then when you do that when you draw them in a style that is not their original style you know you, you kind of take something away from them it's the way i feel when people draw link to be like more of like a real human it's like that's not link though that's just that's just some dude who's dressed like link and i'm going down like this oh fuck it's boss fight time so I bought these Fire Emblem prints because they just, this, this artist, she captured the design of the characters like perfectly. 
So I, I, I couldn't resist. And I hope, because what it is, is um, they were prints for three houses. Oh, sweet. The save point heals me. Okay. I'll, I'll talk more about the prints in a little bit, because I'm... Oh, God. Hey there. Oh, crap. An even bigger one. Demon. I'm not a demon. Let me talk this out. Talk. Yeah, okay. So, my name's, my name's Trace. I have no idea how I got here, but... Demon. Athedo say. Kill. Have it your way. McDonald's or whatever. Um... Please, can you tell me? Oh, hey there. Oh, God. Oh, God. Um. What the fuck? What am I? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Um. Okay, here we go. That. Seems a little uh, too good to be true. And there's that pattern. All right, I think we'll talk more about this. Yeah, it's um. So this woman basically, she drew the three house leaders in their young form. And then she also drew like a, a class photo of the blue lions. And it just looks perfect. Like it, it looks like it's straight out of the game. And I even, I even tried to do some research thinking that maybe she did just like put a still frame from the game and printed that out and was selling that shit. But no, she she was the real deal. Fuck, damn it. Not what I wanted. I had up and down. Oh, this is where I gotta get the jump. Expanded jump. Give it to me. Address disruptor. Corrupts or decorrupts weaker blocks and enemies. Uh, all right, interesting. Okay, that's bizarre. Huh. Uh, that's a really weird power. Oh, so am I gonna have to climb these things going up? Huh. Okay. Huh. But I need to check this out first. So many paths. Anything? Give me the high jump, please. Uh, I'm just, I'm gonna abuse the, oh, come on. How dare you? What is this? Is this the health? Health node, yay! Thank you. Yeah, so I, uh, I bought that, and then I also bought this really nice Smash Bros. print that uh, Don and I have had our eyes on for quite some time. Basically, this person has, has taken on the challenge. Yeah! Check that shit. What is the point of going down there? 
It's a print that we've had our eyes on for a while. Can I... There we go. This artist has taken on the task of drawing every single Smash character. Ooh, what's this? Size note. Okay. Every Smash character on a print. And so... They are currently up to date on all the DLC characters, including everyone's favorite Byleth. And it just, it looks wonderful. And it's crazy because uh, this guy was selling it in either a 12 by 18 or uh, it's probably like a, I don't know. It's, it's, I don't think it's quite a 24 by 36, but it's like, you'd think you want a bigger one to, to make sure you get a good look at every character and you do, but then by making that like extra large print, it, it kind of ruins the color. It distorts it a little bit. So I'm just as happy with, oh God with getting the more average sized print. That's another, I'll, I'll put that on the in a picture as well. And if you check out our Facebook page, 165 Entertainment, I also put up a, a video that I took. Oh God. I see, I see. That's weird. A video that I took of, um, this group that was it was doing like a group Mario Kart cosplay oh sh fuck these guys I hate them uh, so yeah this group was like it was son of a bitch oh that was annoying First death is at the hands of these goddamn jellyfish. Jellyfishing. What just happened? You died. We saved your mind machines. She went to sleep. I died and I'm still me. I wonder, I wonder if this game would have wound up any different if you never died. I'm going to look into that. I'm quite upset that I died. It was, it was probably inevitable. I don't think I was ever going to not die in this playthrough. Oh, sh fuck. Come on, let me in, let me in. Oh, fuck! Oh, there's so much shit! Wow. That was scary. Yeah, so, and... The thing... The thing that I didn't do that I normally do sometimes on both nights is Cards Against Humanity always hosts this uh, it's kind of like a an improv show so what they do is hang on let's sneak up on this fucker is before the show they'll hand well, and, and by the way before I like get into the premise of the show this thing, this show fills up almost immediately. Was, uh, there was one panel, I'm trying to remember which one it was. But the panel that I attended happened... Oh, I'm backtracking. Let me check the map. There was a panel that I had attended that happened right before... Like immediately before the... Oh, excuse me this Cards Against Humanity panel and by the time I got out there was already like 
probably a quarter of the room's worth of a line ready. Ready to fill up that, that room for the panel. And, it, and that panel, the, the cards panel wasn't going to start for another, like, over an hour. Uh, so anyway, the, what the show is, is while people are waiting in line, they'll hand out some blank cards from Cards Against Humanity. And they'll say, you know, I think it's the white cards that are not the, not the prompts, but like the answers or whatever. And they'll say, yeah, I definitely backtracked way too much. They'll say, write, write down a suggestion and we might act out in a skit one of your suggestions. So they'll basically, they'll use, <laughs> that was fun. They'll use a black card from their own stock and use a white card that we draw and then perform a skit around that. And most of the time, those skits are really, really good. It's probably like technical difficulties. Am I? Is it still going on? Did the stream need to buffer at all? It looks like it's doing okay, at least on my phone. Yes, I'd say probably one out of every, or one out of every six skits is like a miss. Everything else is really good. That was okay. Now it's down. Damn it. Man, oh man, oh man, oh man. Let me check something out for a second. Just give me one second. I'm going to see if I can keep up to the stream. Donnie, always, Donnie seems to have the most trouble looking at my streams. So if he says it's fine, I, I'm i going to assume that is a, that is a hard uh, thumbs up. <sighs> Fuck. Where do I go? Uh, I probably got to go back to this stupid ass jellyfish room. Mitch said it looks good. Thank you, Mitch. Hey there. Uh, I'm going to ignore you. Um, let's go down to the right. A boom. I'm in there. I'm out there here. Um, what was the other, what was the thing I just got? Oh yeah, it was the corruptor. Sorry, I'm kind of re, uh, there's probably nothing, okay. Yeah, so basically in, uh, the first night, because uh, they they host those shows on the Saturday night, uh, the Friday night and the Saturday night. So basically, uh, the Friday night, I knew I didn't, you know, I wanted to go, but I didn't because I knew that I was going to have to get up early the next morning, and I kind of just wanted to get home and get to bed. And then the next day, I was invited out to dinner with Johnny and Allison. So, I, I I would have rather done that than to go to the go to the panel. And that's not a statement against the panel. It's just I you know I, I wanted to see my friends. And I 
Ooh. Okay, I, w I want this. And what is it? Be good, be something good. Journal page. It calls itself Zedor. Zedor? Ugh, I farted. Um, this sounds like Scientology. Uh, I don't know how I know this, but I do. Strange that such a, th such a thing would have language. Stranger still that it would have personal identity. One second. Um, oh, God. I'm not sure how long I can last. I lose more and more each passing day. Sound is a deafening throb. Sight is a kaleidoscope fire. Smell and taste open up entire worlds of terror. The worst is touch. A tingling, writhing, itching mass. Oh, you should probably see a doctor. It is expanding, supplanting. There won't be anything to save when it's done. Cool. Who wrote this? I wonder if... Um, my guess... Oh, yes. Oh, I can snipe you. Ha-ha. It's like a bitch. It's probably that, uh, that big machine woman thing was probably a human not unlike me. And now exists as Zeder. Zeder. Um... Yeah, I gotta go to the right some more. Uh, uh, uh. There we go. Yeah, so I had a nice dinner with Johnny and Allison. All right, and then Sunday, you know what? Sunday was kind of cool because here's, here's the thing about, like, the way... I feel about the days of the panel. It's always like Friday. Friday is my personal favorite day because you know it's it's the first day of the panel. It's something that I've been that I look forward to every year, and it's exciting and it's new. And you know, you start thinking about all the stuff that's happened since the last C two E two, and this year. You know, or at least over the past year, we had Fire Emblem, we had Endgame, we had Far From Home, we had Joker, we had Birds of Prey, we had we had Sonic, we had all this really awesome nerd stuff. So I was just really anticipating, like, what kind of cool art am I going to see? What kind of cool new costumes am I going to see? Just all the potential for the cool new stuff that would be coming out. And can I shotgun these guys through plants? Yeah, there we go. I don't know why I didn't think of that before. 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 Yo. Suck my lightning blast. Um, and then Saturday. Saturdays I like. But also, they're kind of tough to deal with because it is the most crowded day. So, it's the day when you can really... It's it's the best for people watching, but it's the worst for almost everything else. Because you're just constantly fighting crowds and shit. You're just... It's just a crowded mess. It's... Um... But it's... It's, it's also when everyone brings their costuming A-game because that's when the the cosplay championship, if that's what you want to call it, that's what they call it at least, uh, that's when that whole thing takes place. It's a whole big showcase. It's really cool. I don't usually go to it, but again, it's that's when people show up in their best costumes. And it's awesome. It's some really good stuff. And then Sunday, 
Sundays I don't usually go to because the thing about Sundays is that since a lot of people are from out of town, then the artists and and the vendors and stuff like that, a lot of them will just start packing up well before the show closes. And the show always starts shutting down earlier in the day than they do on Fridays and Saturdays. Just, you know, that's, that's the nature of the Sundays. So then the first year that I went to a Sunday, it was, it was a little bit depressing. So I was just like, eh, I'm not, you know, since I'm going to go Friday and Saturday, um, I might as well buy the weekend pass because it's always either the same price or maybe an extra five bucks, something like that. Um, but then this year I decided to go mainly because I had nothing going on that Sunday and it was actually surprisingly not crowded, but it probably had the same number of attendees. Well, uh, hello from Northwest Indiana. And, uh, thank you for tuning in. Uh, are you familiar with this game? Because this is definitely my first time playing it. And I'm, I'm having a, a, a pretty decent time with this game so far. I was, I was a little bit worried at first. Because I was, I was doing some kind of, like, some light research on the game beforehand. And the playthrough was only like three hours, maybe four. So I was worried the game was going to be a little bit short. And I mean, it still might be, but um, I think ultimately, depending on how long this game might take, that's going to dictate how I ultimately feel about it. Because it's certainly fun. But if it's not going to last that long, then I would say that it's not necessarily worth the price. But we shall see. Because the boss fights... The boss fights are arguably like the easiest part of this game so far. Especially, especially that second boss. That second boss was nothing. It was standing on a platform and occasional jumping and shooting. Like, I didn't even really have to move left and right all that much. Yes, yeah, so I, I went on Sunday, checked out a few more vendors, um, and what was kind of cool that they had there was they had a nerd-themed bluegrass band performing. And, I mean, they didn't sound the best, but it's just in concept, I got a I got a pretty good kick out of it. Can I break through these? No. Um, they held a couple of trivia contests, and I never would have won those because, like, the very first question was a Star Trek question. I've never seen anything Star Trek related. Did I? Oh, I kind of pressed that by accident. Ow bitch I still don't feel like it. oh god oh god oh god oh god calm down can I come on move forward move forward there you go one two three go ah fuck too soon damn it I'm, I'm gonna die Two, three, there. Yeah, so uh, Sunday I didn't stay for very long, maybe like three hours or something like that. Because even though it was more crowded than I expected, there still weren't really like many panels or anything like that that I wanted to go to. At least nothing that I felt like waiting around for. So I just, you know. Is there anything I can... There's got to be something to do with this thing. No? Okay. 
That's weird. Take that, you bitch. God, there's like a million different doors. I... I'm definitely going to have to do some backtracking at some point. I feel like I'm missing a whole lot of stuff. Well, look, I mean, I'm still alive. I'm still finding safe points. So I must be doing something right. And I wonder if there's going to be any fast travel stations. So I don't have to go back through every little thing. Hey, hang on. What secrets do you hide? Oh, come on. You tease. Um. No. Fuck. I thought I was smart of the game. Whatever I did, I think I did it a little bit too soon. If I could get this damn high jump that I'm pretty sure exists in a game like this. Okay. Unless... Oh, I can't drill through the wall. Oh. Well. Cool. Oh, that was nice. Okay, oh god, oh god. Raining bullets. Die, you fool. And give me health. Okay. This area is very strange. And I'm just gonna go through another fucking door. I miss I gotta be missing a lot. Oh shit, hang on. I should uh I should care. Stop! Oh, I don't like you. I don't like you at all. Got him. Oh, I could. Oh, hey. Got him. There's something very Mega Man ish about. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Stop, stop, stop. You know what this is? It's reminding me of like a, a couple different Mega Man style enemies. One where it's the it's the tiger that sh that shoots the fire. Oh no! It was the tiger that shoots the fire, and then the tube just remind me of. Where, like, the trash or whatever falls from. Take that! Haha! <laughs> Cheesing. Okay. That was nice. That was very smooth. Hey yeah. Um, that's. I guess it's not a huge problem. What is with this area? What am I supposed to. Zombies! Uh, so I can't... I seemingly can't get up here. Haha! Uh... Okay. This is... Uh, not quite sure. Uh, I don't think there's anything I can really do here. Just once again, need that high jump. 
I have a feeling I'm going to have to fight a boss. Not too far from here. Oh, yeah. Save point. There's going to be a boss right around the corner. <coughs> Whoa! Uh, snipe! Hup! Hup! Ow. I really didn't think that fucking thing was gonna hit me. Okay, okay, enough with your stupid fucking minnow attacks. Fuckers. You know what? Shotgun! Got he. Ooh, left or right? I guess I can't really go left. So, right it is. I wonder what the point of these, like, uh, these big green, uh, You've almost bought this game a couple times. You know what? It's if it's on sale, I think I got this for like seven fifty. And if this game continues this trajectory, then I think oh god, oh god. Then I'm fairly happy with the money I spent. I think I bought this on like a Black Friday deal. The same time that I bought Golf Story, which I very much do not regret buying Golf Story. This so far I've been okay with. Okay, Red Door, that's probably a boss fight. Oh, oh, sh fuck these guys. But dude, this music, I don't know if you can hear it, but this music is fucking dope. Especially on this stage. Oh, all these doors are red. Oh god, oh god, okay. Can I... Okay. So I can't quite get up there just yet. It's not still a lot seen on the 3DS, PC, and Switch. Oh, dude, this would be awesome to play on the 3DS. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Stop, please. I gotta get... I just gotta get out of this room. And wait for it. Nick, did you enjoy your time at C2E2? I've been, I've been telling a few... Uh, basic tales of of how I felt about this year's convention fuck ow stop I'm gonna die fuck shit die okay so I can't shrink yet so I can't go through there Oh no. Um can I Nova these guys? <laughs> yeah, I need any sliver of health that I can get out of these fuckers. Oh no, gotta go. Fuck, I died. C2 is great for me. Sunday is too short though. Yes, I I very much agree. It's 
I guess I don't know if you heard me talking about it earlier, but Sunday, Sunday uh, always kind of depresses me a little bit because of how it's one of the least attended. Oh God, I'm pretty far back because it's one of the least attended days, and because a lot of the vendors and artists and stuff like that always start packing up well before the show is about to end, since uh, since a lot of them are out of towners. It's like it's understandable for them, but just for us as con goers, it's uh, it's not fun. It's it's why Sunday is basically my least favorite day to attend. It was still fun. It was probably the most fun Sunday of theirs that I've attended. But like, there's still that aspect of it of like this is it, it's ending. And it's ending too soon, and all that stuff. Alright. I'm gonna watch out for these fucks. Man. I lost a pretty decent amount of progress on that death. Not thrilled. Where was this help before? You know what? Let's 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 see what's through door number one. A save point. God bless America. I mean, look, I didn't lose that much time out of it, but also, fuck. Boom. Fuck. Damn. Fuck. <laughs> It's like the least clever reaction to anything that's... <laughs> fuck, damn fuck. <laughs> Alright. Oh, a po Oh. Can I... No! I thought you'd be able to... God, it tantalizing. How dare you? Oh, God. Be nice. Uh, Sundays when you get deals. Yeah, that's, you know what? You're right. Sun Sunday is when people are looking to unload more of their stock so they don't have to take it with them on their way out. Um, okay, so I haven't gone through this door yet. Let's see what... And, oh my god. Oh, am I going to be able to direct my my Nova shots? That'd be awesome. Uh, let's see if I can actually survive this damn room. Ah, it's these fucks. Okay. Yeah. You know, I, I I do like that this game does seem to have a pretty good uh, a, a good way to remind you. It's like to to use all the powers that you've obtained. Cause there was a point where I almost forgot about the shotgun. Um, there was a point where I almost forgot to use the Nova Blast. I was just going to keep drilling everything. But now there's going to be these motherfuckers. Yeah, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stay back and just pick off this, this jumper. I think I already got him. Sweet. Did you, uh, did you pick up any prints this year, Nick? So I picked up, I got that one dude's uh, essentially complete Smash Bros uh, prints, and then I got me some good old fashioned Fire Emblem prints as well. Uh, switch back to Nova. Yeah, I got him. Um, damn, I 
I can't do like a direct shot down. Yeah. I didn't think they could go through those. All right, that's fine. That's minimal damage. We'll be okay. Can I? Uh, I don't know what's around these corners. Ooh, what's this? Jump, jump. Field disruptor alters local physics to augment jumping a bit. Yeah. That's right, son. Give me that high jump action. Woo! High jump is one of my favorite things to get in a game. And it's like, it's it's, it's boring because it's not even like an actual power. But I just like being able to reach spaces. Take that. Ow, bitch! Right, I, I, I got a little ahead of myself there. So now I need to heal. Yeah! Full health. Got me my high jump. Feeling pretty good about this. Okay. Forgot about you, Fox. Sometimes, uh, just gotta restrain yourself a little bit. Um, where do we go from here? Turn all the lights down now. Okay. Smiling from ear to ear. Stop! Asshole. Stop! Oh my god! Why are these things suddenly like the hardest... Fucking bastards in the game. My goodness. I just lost my ability to play. And, and like, what good does this do me now? Because I can't get through anything. So now I'm going to have to do some, like, a lot of backtracking. Because whatever's fucking in front of me here, I can't get around anything. Doesn't matter. Damn it, damn it, damn it. It was like, I can't. There's a lot of shit that I can't do out here. One of these. Yeah, I still can't control the Nova Blast. And yeah, might as well kill these fuckers again. Get my health back. Okay. Thank you. There's probably no point to that, but. Damn it. Stop. This. Yeah, I still can't do anything there. That sucks. Fuck the disruptor. Got that. Um, yeah, there's no need for that. And then it's a safe point, right? Might as well. I really am just going to have to backtrack a bunch. Damn it. And then I'm going to have to come back here again. This is kind of... Like, I've never played a Castlevania game. And maybe I should at some point. But this... This kind of backtracking just doesn't feel... Interesting or... Oh, God! Can I have some of my health back, please? No? Okay. Yeah, there we go. I guess it wasn't too bad. Wait, hang on. I want to pick this fucker off. Yeah, there we go. Uh, 
hang on. Oh, got him. Okay, so, uh, let's go left. Oh, God. It's not. Yeah. Health, son. And we got the jumper. Something good. Tell me, you know. I mean, he wants to see what is at the down path before I start going too far in, the, in that right, the left direction. Uh, nothing? Because I can't drill through any of this. It's just tantalizing me again. Fuck, stop it. Just give us a tease. Let's call it action tease. Fall into my drill. Ha! -ha. Oh, it's just so satisfying. It's a little bit slower, but I'm enjoying it. <coughs> um, can I just? Yeah. Didn't need that health, but still appreciate the gesture. Got him. Uh, okay. So I'm still backtracking, but now this is new ground. Yeah, save point. Sweet. Thank you. So I probably got about a half hour in me left, give or take. Maybe more, depending on what's a going on. Um. Okay. This seems to be nothing. Hup. All right, this room is currently useless. Cool. See you later. What else we got? It's over here. Oh. Oh, it's boss fight time. Let's see what you got. I'm a... Oh! Oh! Oh, crap indeed. take a minute to uh, appreciate this music. By the way, uh, Nick, thank you for hosting my stream. Always appreciated, my man. Demon, yep. Theodore say kill. Here goes nothing. That's not what I meant to do. Ow, stop. Fuck. That. Stop. Oh, God. This constant. Man, I am, I am getting my ass handed to me. Holy fuck. Stop. Fuck, I can't. Oh my god. That. Alright, you know what? I did ask for a more difficult boss fight. The game has delivered. But come on, dude. Ugh, excuse me. It's the poison water and shit. That's. Because it's not even like the. Bosses' movements or whatever are hard to track. It's just 
It's poison water two feet in front of me. It's barraging little pellets at me. And it's shooting this stupid laser at me. Stop! And now I'm like extra little, so it's hard to... Take that. Ah. All right, I just need to time that a little bit better. So actually, I'm safe up here. <laughs> Nerd. All right, now now that I get it, it's way easy. Except, uh... All right, I can still get a few shots in on that, on that cannon arm. I gotta make sure I'm close to the mic. There's, there's still a little bit of, uh, like a little bit of an audio fix that I'm gonna be working on soon. There's a lot of, there's a lot of channel stuff that I need to work on. And it's, but it's all, it's all really good stuff. This, we're starting to see little bits and pieces of success that we've, um, we've all worked really hard to achieve and it's, I have to check our YouTube subscriber count because since that was always like our first part of this whole recording and streaming endeavor, you know, since that was always our main focus, uh, what do I do now? What the hell? Well, I mean, I can... <sighs> Fuck. What is there left to... Ow. I can't die here. But I don't know what... I'm not quite sure what I'm supposed to be hitting right now. Oh, okay. These stupid nodes that are shooting out there. Okay. A new weapon has just been unleashed. Unfortunately, it only seems to be shooting downwards. But now what? This bus is kind of really confusing. Uh. What the? F I really want that health. But I'm not, I don't know what I'm supposed to be hitting. It's kind of cool because it seems like if he stays just only shooting in this one direction. Right. What? <laughs> What is- this boss is fucking stupid! Like, what- What am I supposed to do? What is there left to shoot? Seems like all of his... Little damage nodes... Oh, wait, maybe when his- his mouth is open? Yeah, there we go, okay.
So, I mean, I could play it safe and just... No, that's not going to work. Um... Fuck, I do need to kind of be... All right, so now that I now that I figured out his pattern, this boss is insanely easy. I just got to be extra careful because I am fairly low on health. I really want to collect the health that's already like set loose out there. Oh, he's turning red. He's turning red. Uh, die, you. Fucking pig, come on, I've got you all figured out. You're not. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Now, can you let me. Oh, I got a fucking. Of course. All right, all right. I'm no dummy. Whoops. Maybe I am a little uh, on the dumb dumb side. Wait. Hey, come back. Um. This is probably my least favorite element of the game. This this little oh God. there whoops How can I, 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 can I have this thing please, this health node, I mean I'm glad I can like, fucking see myself again. This power filter, yes I still need some time for poison to clear, but I will be okay now. Are you well enough to tell me what's going on? I hope so. Yes, but it is long story. I'm listening. There are two sides to the universe. World stream and breach. Breach is like storm. Deadly. Cannot be passed. This planet, Sudra, is designed to keep Breach in check. But then, many years in past, a man came through. His name is Athedos. Athedos is pattern mind, powerful manipulator. Oh. He infected all of Sudra with pathogen. We only survive. Rusalki like me. What? 
to trap a fuse breach a tractor what the fuck breach surrounds entire world now and we cannot leave but Athedos is win. Soon he will destroy us and enter rest of world stream. Trace my sister Ophelia. Tra uh, Trace my sister Ophelia. Find you in breach. Only you, no other, can stop Athedos. Athedos, whatever. She found me in this breach. What ex what exactly does that mean? Unfortunately, I am not knowing. Only Ophelia entered breach, and she is damaged. So why me? The whole Chosen One story doesn't inspire much confidence. Only Ophelia knows. This is my next task. Also, enable repair drones to fix Ophelia and other Rusalka. Ophelia has a way to circumvent pathogen, which you will want. Am I in danger, or could I already be infected and not know it? Pathogen is now in all creatures here. But you can heal inside egg, so maybe not. Thanks for being so forthcoming about all this. I'll help you, not that it seems like there's a choice. But I'm going to expect some answers from your friends. <laughs> okay, go. I am always watch you. If you need me, call. Okay, you'd think that would have answered some questions. Can you please, can you open these doors, please? I would very much like to get that health node. But it kind of seems like you're not going to, so fuck you. Ooh, what's this? Modified lab coat. Double tap. Double tap and hold while pressing it against the wall to teleport across. It's not a lab coat like from the laser lab. But the inner layer is different. It looks biomechanoid like my gun. How the hell did it get here? Okay. That is bizarre. That, oh, that is, that is something. Oh, fuck. Ah, shit. Stop, get on the... Okay. Thank you. Much better. Yeah, buddy. Ow. Ah, fuck this poison. Whatever, just, just fucking, just run. Just run, just run. Who gives a fuck? Kim Kardashian. Let me go save. So much has happened. This game is special. I'm... Uh... uh. All right, so I can teleport through those. But it probably doesn't do me much good. Mm, but yeah. Yeah, because I still can't get up there. Yeah, I can't go through there. Can't go through there. So am I going to get an even higher jump, then? That hallway. Once again, tantalizing. 
All right, so let's do a little bit of backtracking now. Okay. Okay, okay, all right, all right, all right, all right. You know what? You are not very nice. I, I just wanted you to know that. I can't fit through there yet. Um, just a little bit. Oh, f I always forget about you, fucker. All right. Is there any... I don't remember what was down below this door. Oh, I can't go through there. And I can't go through there. So if that's there, I can't do that. I still gotta keep going to the right anyway. Oh, yes. Running, running with my drill. Give me health. Okay. She's gonna tank it. I have the health to tank it. But if you guys want to give me health, that would be mighty helpful. Ow, you fuck. Stop. Bad. That. Yeah, there we go. Ah, that didn't do much. Yep. This will help. Thank you. So I gotta let's let's try. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Haha. You fool. You can do nothing. You are powerless to stop me. Anything here yet? This is still. Haha. -ha. Uh, it's still kind of useless though. Oh, it's just an interesting. I can sort of shoot through that. Can I actually? Oh, okay, hang on. So there's still a little bit of unexplored space. Alright, alright, guys. You wanna... wanna... See ya. Look, you did that to yourself, bitch. I don't think it does, but I wonder if that shit hurts me. Yeah. Yeah. Health node. Awesome. Health node. F oh, health node fragment. At least it healed me. Hiya. Here I am. Here we go. Nice waiting to begin tonight. <laughs> you fool. And you. 
Ah, uh, fuck. Oh. Well. Alright, I'll just... Okay. Uh, I think that was the only point of this area. Was that fragment? Just kind of weird. But, I mean, that seems to be it. Moving on. Okay. I don't even want to deal with you fuckers right now. Worthless. Yes, I haven't done anything in this area yet. What is what the fuck is this supposed to be? It's nothing. Oh shit, yeah. Oh. But there's that one spot I could probably do the the teleporting trick. Where I was trying to get that one power up. But that was a fucking way, way back. Oh my god. What the fuck is this? Are you Ophelia? Trace, this is... Nope, this is Veruska. She's in great need of repair drones. She is very dangerous. But is our ally. Dangerous? I mean, I'd figure you were sort of networked supercomputers or something. Our, our word is Rusalki. It is like water machine. We have all been damaged. The situation you see is emergency. If you can enable, if you can enable repair drones, it will greatly help. So just the power filter isn't enough? That is bare minimum for survival. Okay, hang in it. Hang in there. Whatever you are, I'm not going to let you die without a fight. Thank you. Alright, but... Take that! What about a drill to the face? Will that help? Uh, oh, I can't... Okay, that was useless. So, re-backtracking. Backtracking, backtracking. Hey there. Not cool. Stay away. Ow. Fuck. Hi yo. Thank you. Any more? Oh, you'll be there. And you're there. And you're there. And you're there. And you're there. Just gonna chill out here. Kind of spawn camping. Oh, that was perfect. Oh, so much backtrack. And now I can finally get up there. All right, come on. Let's let's get together. You want to stop? Your movements are a little bit tricky to track. Can I? Probably not, but it's worth a shot. Oh fuck! I forgot to auto aim or. You look like you're a woman who's like trying to do a crab walk. Fuck! Stop! Ah. Fine, stay down there. See what I care. Where is this? Fuck. I 
guess I'll follow this up some more. I'm not sure where exactly. Okay, so I can't. Ooh. Wait a second. Did I just like re backtrack? I f God bless my n f nutsack. I like re backtracked on myself. Wow. I should be ashamed of myself. going ow come on mutton chops killer so this is still locked let me check the map again yeah, I, I guess I don't really have much choice but to go this way. So fuck all y'all. Oh. Dive. Ow, ow, ow. Sweet. Ah. <laughs> yes. Give me that shit. I know. Fragment, but still heal me. I wonder if that's that's probably going to be the way it is from now on. Is that I'm only going to be getting fragments anymore? Your nuts have been blessed. Ah, oh, thank you. That's that's. Yeah. I'm really set for life now that I have a sacred nutsack. That's 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 really gonna be like my opening line to the to the ladies now is Whoa, hey there. Range Ooh I well look, I didn't even know my stuff had limited range. So that's I guess, I don't know, kind of made me feel a little empty. Oh, fuck! Did I just, was I just like completely ignorant of that or was that fucker like invisible until I got there? That was frightening. Can I get in there? No. Oh, fuck these sex stars. You're invisible now. God. Why would you do that to me? Oh, that's going to fuck with me. Oh, what is this? Is this a sword? Bioflux. Flu <clears throat> Bioflux accelerator. Causes mutation at max health. The fuck? A syringe lying in the middle of a room? That's just ominous. This contains how you say small blood machines, like in your mind. They can provide powerful modification. Please take them. Don't tell me you want me to stick myself with this thing. Too late. I have, I have transferred necessary info using near connection. Your body will produce now. Injection over wireless? Some Somehow that's even more terrifying. What did you do to me? You will find this useful, but only works if you are uninjured. Thanks, I guess. What the fuck? I have tentacles. Oh, it fires with me. What the fuck? Oh my god. Can it can it fire in the same direction as me? Oh, it only fires forward. 
Still, holy shit, this is bizarre. Oh, I got tentacles. Hang on. Yeah, yeah, I lost my tentacles. Ah, I can shock on this bitch. Take that. I know, I know that I know that was a bad fight. Played it all wrong. I definitely haven't been through here yet. What are these? Oh my god. What's the point of even going down here? Oh, I'm going to lose so much health if I try to do this shit. I don't think there's... <sighs> Whatever, I'll take it. No, it's worthless. It's just worthless. It's just worthless. Like, why? I... I... I feel like there's something I'm, I'm missing by not going down there. But right now, I kind of don't care. I need to heal. Right, I'm going to do a little bit more backtracking than I, I'll probably call it for the night. So I think there's a... F Hang on. I need to double check the map for something. No, I actually, I gotta go back, go back and down left. Is there, yeah, how do I? So I, I did this already. Oh, come on. I can go through there. Fuck. I'm... I'm very confused right now. Um, because I had, <sighs> unless I'm forgetting something, I feel like I, because I can't go up to the left, maybe there's, uh, no, I can't get to that top right space. I guess maybe I haven't really explored this. This right side yet that much. <sighs> Fuck. I really wish there was fast travel between save points or something. I, I get it. Backtracking is like one of the key components of this game, but. Oh, damn it. I'm stupid. Sometimes it's just a, a labor. It's just a labor. Alright. Alright. Uh, you killed my tentacles. Wait. Wait. Oh, fuck. This was this shit that I forgot to do this whole time. Um, the map, 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 
that map. Can go right, right up, right up. Yeah, no, that's it's off. I don't feel like. What the fuck? You guys suck. Damn it. It's just, it's worthless hiding down there. It, it's truly worthless. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Wow. That was sloppy. That was sloppy as fuck. Whatever. That was just annoying. Where am I? Uh, wow. Wow. All over my... Mm. Alright. Here we go. Look, I... I, I, I did that to myself. I, I was just trying to speed up this process a little bit. Oh, I'm stupid. Wait. I have to do it from here. Come on. Come on, crab walker. And boom. Wait a second. Oh, that's why. Okay, I was about to say. I, I knew I started that earlier, but... I didn't know where slash how. I couldn't remember anyway. So let's just keep going. Let's keep doing uppies. Let the roly poly do its thing. Hup. Gotcha. Oh, fucker. I just, I just healed. And I just lost like a quarter of my health already. Fuck. You little turds. So it should be what? Straight right from here? Yeah. And then you. I remember this time. Die. Die. Got him. Got him. Got him. Got him. Aha. I'm slowly catching on. So satisfying. Oh, I jumped into it. Oh, I could have gone through unscathed. <sighs> okay. Let me get that save point. Wait for it. And Gotti. So I'll, I'll, I'll do a little bit more progressing. Oh, he fucking did it. You. And I gotta stop falling for that. Still can't do that. Let's teleport through the other side. Yeah, I know. That stupid little trick is taking a lot of my health. Guess what? I got a trick of my own. And 
Actually, have I been doing this a stupid way? I sure have. Are there any nice little doodads back here? Haha! <laughs> Bitch! Climbing and climbing, 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 climbing. Uh, yes. Oh, fuck yes. Give me that. Increases weapon and item damage. Hell yeah. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh my god! That is a terrifying new enemy. Not a fan. Just can't get through there. Whoops. Can't go through there. Just gotta go up here. Oh. Oh, I'm outside! Woo! Presumably fresh air. Oh. It, so much better. Ho! Oh, hey there. Friend or foe, friend or foe. Well, I can't hurt you. Seemingly. Fuck. All right. Got him. This area is really bizarre. What is with these fucking turtle skeleton things? Am I am I missing a weapon or am I not supposed to be able to attack them? And also I really oh I'm so tempted to leap of faith it across. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hurry, please. Thank you. Oh, come on. Well. Keep going. There you go. Hurt. I feel like there's a whole lot of stuff there I didn't explore. My mic. Damn it, I keep moving my the mic arm. And what the fuck is this thing? Well, it was easy to kill, so let's Let's keep exploring. Before I enter any more dang doors. Oh, 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 boulder! Okay. Uh, oh God! Stop, please. Oh come on! You really gonna can follow me? Stop! Oh you. Uh, well, let's take this thing out at least. I just want to reach the next safe point. Get some health. Let me explore a little bit. Okay. Yeah. All right. I wonder if I'll get like a hookshot power up. Ow. Oh, I'm going to die. I'll 
Save point, please. Please, save point. That is not... This is nothing! Fuck! Oh, God. Uh... Alright. Save point. Come on! That's... Uh, again, that's nothing! Oh, these fucking worthless ass doors. Can, I, can you please spare some health? Ah, oh, come on. I'm dying here. I'm, I'm, I am screwed. I'm just straight up screwed. Die. Come on. Health. Now, please. Health. For fuck's sake. Uh. Safe point. Oh, thank God. All right. I I really do want to keep exploring this area, but it's also getting kind of close to my bedtime. So I think this is where I'm going to wrap this up. Um, you know what? I was I started out obviously like really enjoying this game cuz it's very Metroid-esque. And then it kind of dipped a little bit in the middle but now now as I'm gaining some more of my powers and exploring some new areas and like starting to actually get challenged a little bit um I'm starting to dig this again I'm uh, uh good night Mitch thanks thanks for tuning in you're you're a you're a good dude so right so I'm gonna wrap it up from here so it's Wednesday night tonight uh tomorrow night I don't know who's streaming. It's going to be down to either myself with some more of this, possibly Gibbo doing one of his variety streams, possibly Greg doing another Kingdom Hearts stream. This is something that we're going to need to figure out as the Donovans are continuing to uh, fix their setup at the moment. So, other than that, um,. Yeah, thanks for watching. If you are a new viewer to this channel, please follow us on Twitch. Follow us on YouTube, also 165 Entertainment, where we upload our stream VODs, where we have a few separate gameplay videos, some movie reviews and commentary tracks. Follow us on Facebook, also 165 Entertainment, where we do more movie reviews, some uh, random variety posts here and there. Uh, do, 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 and for sure, I will be back streaming this game on Friday. Like I said, tomorrow night's kind of up in the air at the moment. And we are slowly building up our Twitch page as we just became eligible for affiliate status. And that is all thanks to you, the loyal viewers and followers. Thank you very much for that. It is, it is a very big deal to us. Um, I don't think if there's any other cleanup I need to do. I don't think so. So with that, I'm just going to say goodnight. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you later. Goodbye, goodnight.